Little jump spot there. Info gained. You've seen them crossing over towards short. Have I? Well, not you, like Payne. And now Neck is <laughs> Molotov out. TRK running a mark, moving in, but there is this quad stack. Oh. It's gone in a second. Three kills very, very quickly. And a dink to Hardzow as well. Big Azera moving in on this rotation. P2K needs to be P2 King as he's left in this one. Oh. One versus three, and he's run down by TRK, who comes in with a big a jump spotting player. Very close. But not quite. They're going to run it. They're going to commit off the back. They know the jig is up. There are five here. And Payne are going to be able to put a stop to the first two. Flashes to try and hold back the monster push. But it hasn't really slowed it down. PKL and Big Azera. Well, actually, now just PKL. His teammate's been smoked off. But a smoke spam goes a long way to bring this back into a two-on-two. Nithon sat up in heaven. Oh. And the smoke spam again for Big Azera. Dirty. Short belongs to him. You can throw smokes, you can throw mollies, but this guy's still coming at you. TRK slipped the net. It would have to be another big round from TRK. And as he makes noise on this rotate, oh, the AWP is no. on him. And Nithon doesn't miss those. Pain do get... I don't know why I would say that. It feels like trying to curse Team 1. Yeah, attempting fight. Hopefully, if you acknowledge it, that counters the... Yeah, but then you acknowledge that you've already acknowledged oh, it. No. Does that go back? But surely... Like, on one step further. Yeah, so... Don't I don't stop know. Here. Nithon, gonna nail that shot. TRK. And you just go B, right? You've seen the AWP on upper. You're already three monster off that double kill. There are two hit players here for pain. It's a nice setup. Nithon, if he, if he just begins a rotate out of a gamble, this could still be a three on five. Oh, the nade. The nade is good. It lands right in Kaze's head because Zera doesn't see that short play, but PKL is putting up a masterclass right now. Nade won't stop him. Can the player? Yes. Pesadeo causes problems, and now he's alone. Pain with a three on five. Look, man, they grew an ear on a, on a rat. They can do anything. That's true. And X and S, he hears it all down here towards Monster. Little double up has really put pressure on Pain. They're scrambling, rotates oh. down towards B, and it's not even set in stone that this is a B play yet. I say that, it, it's kind of weird. Right now, oh, Team 1 are worlds apart, and there's no trade potential on these kills. Nithon. If he wins this fight, he sets Payne up. And with the rotation, it's actually PKL to steal it away. What on earth? That is so brutal. The bomb was going back to B. He was going to try and rejoin X and S as he was deep. And with him falling, you know, the bomb got stuck in limbo. Wasn't really sure where to commit, where to go. Two A players die on the split a push of long and short and it felt like team one just spread themselves way too thinly in a four on two the bomb was just late they called they had a two on one they saw a b player and they go let's two on one that a site but pain was so quick on rotate and they're already ready down on b nithon has stepped up in this game he was oh uh, sorry minus one and three he's now seven and three that's again is causing problems pain just keep getting this orb off trk close toilets uh, Nathan's pushed long, wow. and they are up short right now. He plays <laughs> Trigger Discipline for a second, Ooh. but he's traded after the first. That could have been so much more out of Nathan's AWP. Instead, four on four with the A site overwhelmed. These deep players up past nice. Nathan in the toilets are oh. here way quicker than Payne were ready for. They're even entering B at the same time. Both bomb sites and both succeed. XMS pulls out at the end, but. No problem, team one. That was a nice rotate. Bit awkward because, you know, Payne, even though they hear that A play come in after Nithon dies, they they weren't expecting team one to be in the bomb site. Yeah. And and that confirmation, once they once Nithon gets killed in, in party, team one know they have A. They know that's a solo player with him being so deep in the late round. Very awkward, but I, I, it's cool how much Payne are entrusting Nithon with these solo site holds. It's for a reason. He's such an explosive AWP player. And we keep see him, uh, seeing him, you know, solo behind dice while they're heavy stack. Early pop for Team 1. They're going through the smoke. It might be a read off the back of that lack of monster control. There's no one here. Only Neck is on the site. A late flash blinds them both as the CTs throw one as well. Sitting in the molly, jumping over. Neck is gets nothing done. It's PKL putting up two instead. Flank from connector. And everything is going down on this B bomb site. Deo in the smoke for the second he follows up on short. Nithon now, solo A, back in the bomb site and here for vengeance. Orp on Orp. 
Mifan hasn't had to take this AWP v AWP fight just yet. Hasn't had to win this fight. And so here he is wrapping in through CT. Maluki is already on yeah. the angle. You are yeah. going to struggle to win this one. Maluki should have oh! it, but a missed shot. Oh, dear. Now the gap's getting closed. Now Nython's moving in. He's been given a golden opportunity here. Checking top boxes, but Maluki's crossed the pillar. Nython looks aware. Oh, dancing around. Oh! And that's a quick shot out of Nython to win it. One versus two. And he locks it in, in this, uh, this four on three. Bomb plant in for Maluki. But a rough spot to be in. Short's been quiet for a while, but eventually they're going to have to consider it because there's still this Conrath on the cards. Wow. That's a nice shot from Maluki's AWP. Oh. oh, he's back on connector in time. And he even follows up with a tag. That's more like it, Maluki. Good for the double. And he leaves it all on Kai's now. One versus two. Trapped in at the pillar. And he knows about this short player. Out from Khan no. and finished off. It's a clutch going the way of Team 1. You know, it, he, he kind of, you want more wow. than a one for one out of this, but you're going to struggle to get that. It's a good check from TRK. He has A4, he lives there. He, he definitely yeah, gets a kill. Yeah, the shorter barrel. Yeah. And so, you know, not even going one for one in that position, that really is, you know, worst case Ontario. Nice on. Follows up at least in his stalwart defense of this A bomb site, and he's allowed this two man stack to stay and play at B. This is the change we talked about, right? The idea of having monster presence to stop these reaction plays into the oh, B site, oh. and it will stand the test of time. Maluki in the clutch, can't land the opener, and so Payne coming with as much of an issue. Now that bomb is still very far away. And because you don't know about Connector, you're kind of antsy on this rotate. They wanted to drop down to B, but as mentioned, they don't know what's happening on this side of the map. Oh, Pain have actually stacked B out of the worry of this because it went silent and they saw the guys going back towards Con. And only now the penny drops that this A-bomb oh. site is overran. Yeah, I think it's also the, the info, like Payne realized it had all been spotted on upper. And so, you know, Team 1, when they've seen all this A-presence, they've gone back to what works, that B-site. This time they just, like you say, late commit. And they've completely got Payne out of position. There's a smoke and two kits. So Hardzow could get weird with it. With his long post plant, it's not going to be expected. Both players tucked in. There's a free kill. Quick trade for Hardzow. Still got that smoke, but you can see he's not ready for these post plant positions. One at long, no, and he's going to get the kill. TRK with vision into connector. It allows yeah. them to see if anyone's come back down. And now that they haven't got that info, now that they haven't seen anybody, they're going to send the nightmare back up into the A site. It even just forces one more smoke, as we saw, right? Like Payne have to smoke that gap so they don't get, you know, pinched between short and connector. So just a bit more util wasted. Trading a nade for a smoke is, is a very good trade on CT. PKL, he can clear this, and oh well, the kill comes to him, but he won't win. Maluki, very low, tucked in close, and Kay's trying to cover. Even though we have this nice A stack, it can still get out of control with a couple of rifles picked up. Mesa Dale will not allow it, goes ahead of the smoke, and even though Maluki died, there's no problem in this round. The nightmare continues. Ganesh could still cut it off. If he goes short water instead of T-spawn, he can cut this all off right now. Even if he just gets the info, he sees legs, he doesn't even fire. They've cleared monster, or so they think. And right now, Team 1 have the drop. Yeah, he's going to move in, wrap the short side. This is where they just came from. It's actually a really nice maneuver. They're probably considering maybe there's wow. a weird timing monster, but they're certainly not ready for someone on short. Hot on their heels right behind them, but it's flanks on flanks. Nithon's pushing through the A site. Oh, man. Exodus waiting, hoping the guys can get into position. But the longer he takes, the longer they wait, the more impact this wraparound from Nithon's going to have. Oh. Now, the bomb isn't planted for him. So the fact that Big Azera wins that fight out is massive. XNS is left looking for ghosts. He doesn't know where Whoa. the second man is. <laughs> and he can't wrestle with that A1S to get it back under control. And you see They've got the read on this one, and they would be right. It is looking like oh. this A play. Now, oh, Pesadello dear. didn't know that Nekiz oh. was so close. The Deagle... Running low on ammo, oh still God. looking for the oh challenge, God. overwhelmed by the pistols, and only one out of the sight hole. This is falling apart. Trying to do what he can is X and S. He's at least giving them a reason to look into this site, to look into winning this round. It should have been Team 1's. But somehow the pistols have found a way, thanks to Pesadello getting a little over-aggressive. On the short side, the AWP now rallies out with a shot, and it's left to TRK. 
Yeah, no kit, no smoke, no chance. You'd think this orb is rerouting, and PKL waits for no one, just wins that fight up front. That's all. He's looking for a second man. There's not one because Era does catch Pesadeo going up. It wasn't K's though. He's reset from B. Neckers cleans out the top site. And now the problems are averted for Pain. The only issue is how long it's going to take to get this bomb here. But those CTs don't want to announce their rotates. So they're sneaking in. Oh, Molly on the, uh, on the plant. Goes out a little early and it misses as well. Dear. So, uh, double negative, but this one doesn't equal a positive for Team 1. Neck is set up over on the truck, just waiting for a bank swing. This crossfire in the site is going to be pretty nice. As the attention is pulled in onto the dice box, Neck is going to have oh. a good bit of room to work with. And so he drops the first man, follows up with another. It's quick, we know it. It's a safe jump. Will he do it again? 30 seconds. Can't wait forever. He saw something. Not enough to take a kill, but enough to keep that in the back of his mind. There's an AWP on the site, he says. And there's some re-aggression. Neck is not again. He's been holding these amazing timings, but he's just missed one. He might be on a backstab. They've seen him. Neck has just got the ball. Uh, the ball and he's going to take down Kares. It's only AWP. It's only Maluki. And he's got to perform two kills. They're running him down. There's only 10 seconds. One shot. Ought to do it. And his team are already here, causing commotion. Maluki's won it. And he's even got the third to boot. Just knifed on holding on, but that means nothing. Money was never the problem. Team one have hold on, held on for one. Never take off. Oh, it's I a bit of a this. B play from Payne, this. a change of pace out through no Monster here. and into the face of Team One. They're very lax on B. They've not been used to this kind oh. of speed. And so down with TRK. Neck is will get traded, but still it's siding with Payne in this one. It's damage done to Pesadello and a four on two as Payne overwhelmed the B site to try and steal Team One's map pick away. There's no hope. There's no saving grace. There's no chance. Shot in the head. Maluki swung by Hard Zhao, and now it's K's. 1v4 gone and done. Payne have picked it up. Their opponent's map pick. Booyah, run it back into top. There's a triple ramp flank, and Nithon's got the opening kill. That was a one-man there. If you're running this pistol, it's strange to see a play committed in the bomb site. The flank is even red. Nekis doubles up on it, and Nithon helps out as well. It's a clean round. Yeah, even even stuff like that for Team One. It you look at it and you go, if you're if you're running the ra a triple ramp into a flank, why are you committed with it? A right? That's essentially a retake setup. You should be leaning towards a retake, not. You know, dying with your ship, taking one down with you. But it's not the end of the world. It is just the pistol. It's only the most important round, as they say. And basically, they're saving nothing. Bit of Kev. And Kev ain't too pleased about it. Nice shot. Pesadeo was the standout player for Team 1 last map at least, so that's something to fall back on, but he won't survive the pistol either. Over the top, now they've got the info. Still that main split's coming in. Nekis has got the kill. Oh, they don't check CT, Ben. TikTok. Bomb now dropped with very little time left, but they're going to get it into the site just in time. Plant coming in with seconds to spare. Lobby crunch from Team 1 looking to propel this retake into action. A man down. Looking to get rid of that AWP. Here they come, out through see, uh, out, out through lobby rather. Three on two as they make their way in and suddenly, Bigazera is left in the 1v1. Tap on the bomb, aid's good nice. and Pesadello is dead. Cut down by the... Still re -aggressive. It's not the only one, Pesadello even picks. KL outside and hards out. When he gets rid of that rifle, the scout hits a tag. Careful, when Neck is now dead to Maluki's Deagle, this eco is getting tantalizing. Three on four. Vent broken and likely hurt. The rotate. Maluki's followed up. And now we've got to wait on the heaven wrap. Because Eric can't die. He's got to do the bomb work in this round. Go back and get it off the roof. Wondering where it's gone. Does he know? Meanwhile, nice blue ramp flank. This is awkward though. He's been caught in a time in case. Runs back down lower. This is weird. Now they can be ready for a heaven play. Because Zero's got the bomb back off roof. And even though they have heaven, there's still two players in the site. Oh dear. 
because it's so uncomfortable for pain. I do like that Nighton is just waiting. Oh, They've cut the bomb off, though. Oh, my. Yes. You look right at him. Oh, my God. Wow. Dropping in. Still dead after one. That could have been so much more, and really, it needed to be. Only Knight on left standing, and yeah, he is just uh, cut down on his rotate out of heaven. Nice reaction. See that he's going to have to put a stop to single handedly. Can he don the hero mask? Tucked in, they don't know about oh. him, and he is gone immediately. Big Azera just wants to watch the world burn as him and his team lay waste to this B bomb site. Pain is just so well drilled, man. The way they enter that bomb site is that of a team with great communication. You know, they, they all triple split in the same second, single double window. Everyone comes out at the same time. So no doubt that someone is tasked with checking that corner. And the right side ramp smoke gives you the freedom to check that 50-50 angle. And it's 100%. It's not a 50-50 anymore. If he's there, he's dead. That's oh, so ready. Quick kill. Maluki's got him cornered. Missed shot with the orb. Pistol's out. Does recover it. Maluki's <laughs> USP is better than his orb, at least in this map. Can he get any more from it? Oh, the molly's nice. The smoke baited out of him. Quick flick back around for Maluki, but... Look at the control they have. Yeah, they're all the way outside. And... Maybe. They've literally got all these key areas of the map, like so many options open to you right now. You can just go to where the success is found with PKL holding on to heaven. Maluki might be about to rotate up into him. He's missed this timing to check for oh. it. PKL, that's a freebie, and there's nothing that Team One can do about it. And so now that you get that A pick, the bomb's just going to move in, just going to join up with you. Oh, dear. Oh, nice Maluki, shot. good reaction. Gets that back under control. I thought he was a dead man. He might still be. <laughs> yeah, Nithon. Dude, as far as... Towards yeah. outside early on. They're like, okay, guys, yeah. yeah. Harry and Hugo, all right. We need to get outside under control. And then look at that entry. Just tap through yeah. a smoke. <laughs> Ouch. That's like the worst feeling. There's just no accounting for it. Like, nothing you could have done changes the outcome of what just happened. You got smoke one tap. Like, okay. Cool. And then walking main, going for an A split. No, nah, no, nah, but Pesadello is in prime location to try and do something yeah. about this. These Ooh. are the protocols what? that Team One have been missing, <laughs> having any sort of response outside. Now, with going heavy outside does come limitations elsewhere. Oh, and yeah. Nithon, luckily enough, is looking the wrong way. And I say luckily enough because Team One needs to build something on this CT side. Nice. They need to have a couple of rounds to go off of. Carpets rolled out. Still pays there. Swings through the door and catches him by surprise, but he's committed in the site. They're ready to trade. He's playing with nades. And Maluki, well, he will kill one guy late on the ramp. Luck. It's still a B play with three on three in the post plant. Oh, they were not ready for that. Yeah, big kill for Maluki. Opens up a route to winning the round now. Going to play behind the double doors on Big Azera. PKL going to be left fighting from the Astralis plant, plant spot right now. Big Zera, he's the guy who could do it all if he gets this double. Oh, they close the door! And he comes in with the response, a little transfer. Only Maluki left to be off and good in the clutches. Off and good in the clutch. Nice. And there he is to get it over the line. The 1v1 going his way. And with just enough time left to defuse, he's served Team 1 up around. Maluki in hell. Gonna try and take a swing. Oh. You know, he doesn't really have many options. They at least deal with Big Azera down on B. That's a really nice response, honestly. It's gonna force a bit of a switch up out of pain. And they get caught crossing with the bomb. Hards out, trades it, regains that control. And now they just saunter into this A bomb site. Neckers is even holding for these rotations. Oh, no. One for one is enough. And so now a clutch asked for from Kai's in the 1v2. Sneaks up the ladder, he's got kit, but there's a late heaven flank that he'll never be planning on. He might even walk into it. Nithon now, by process of elimination, knows he's up top. The util's gonna go in. <laughs> oh, maybe even the knife. Oh, the ladder. He wanted the knife so badly, but as soon as Kai's shot on lower, oh, they can't escape him. Seeks out a skull. Now that he's got the first, mate, he is terrifying. Yeah. Oh, they're right above him. Shut the door. Get out. Give them the B-bomb site. Now nah, he'll face everything. Yeah. Watch him go. Seriously. He he's he's dancing around with the orb. Oh. He's looking for ways back in. 
When he's in this mindset, he wants to take every single fight you're willing to give him. Oh, oh that's a tag through the smoke. Nithon bought down low. Gonna try and repeat this. Gonna try and deal with it. They have found the first onto X and S. And the turn from Big Azera has dealt with the ramp component. TRK comes in swinging. There's another man up in the site that he needs to find. He needs oh. to locate and he will deal with him. Nice. Big Azera is dead as well. And TRK goes on a tear to make that happen. Him and Maluki lock it in between the two of them. And so Team 1 slowly but surely piecing together. Scott free. And what will they do with this? Often when he's been in lower, like the team cities haven't even known about it. He's been walking up on these ramp players. Surely K is, is considering this. Surely someone said, yo, he could be down bent. A leg shot is not enough, but he follows up with a kill. Maluki has cover this time. K's is dead on ramp, by the way, but they can't get to him because the kills keep flowing Hot through hands. lobby. Maluki, highlight reel with another finally put down. And now PKL, he wants to run away, but he's being pushed in lobby. TRK can't drop the ball. Bomb, and it's only Pesadeo smoking himself off is such a nice play here, waiting for his teammate to come back up from behind. Hardtail won't make a rush up the vent. And again, they know he's down lower, but he could be anywhere now. He got the ramp kill. And he's heard Pesadeo up top. PKL walking, now running, has been heard. Pesadero is considering this play could be climbing vent, but how's the timing going to look? He turns around, and it's the worst timing in the world. 11-4 for Payne. In Antwerp, as they've taken a 2-1 over Sal Catano. More of that later, though. It's another A hit, another quick one. Shotgun by the Hutt indeed, Harry, and it's putting up a masterclass. Another kill before it's down. Still, 2-1-2, two two, and yeah, it's only pistols, but this is a great position to be in, even with the limitations. Down B they go, PKL's here. Yeah, very good read to recognize that with the situation getting so wild, they might try to vent drop. PKL is going to be way faster than they are ready for. The double doors swing open, and he starts to creep in on the back of it. Oh, P250's great. locked out, and so now only neck is... Oh, Dink from the USP Scary. almost made it interesting. TR will just back out. Now calling for rotations. Oh. Mag7 on Big Azera wins in lobby. They deal with that first rotate down lower. PKL's even been mopped up trying to fast wrap secret. Oh, they're not convinced. They're not convinced. They were about to drop B because Zara's towing the line. Door gets open. They go for a single door play. They just want to plant and go back to decon. I thought he was trying to flank the orb. He could catch Maluki looking the wrong way. Instead, he's going for the fight out B. Oh, Deagle will not connect. Maluki will. Second kill of the round on this orb, and he's got one point of rotation cut off as Payne have to save to guaranteed round for team one. This gap closing slowly but surely as Payne receive exactly that. Setup, but that hut is is a wide chasm right now. No one's watching it. They're both on the door at the moment. Vink's gonna have to flick back as they start running out. The flash is good. They get the kill. There's a trade. There's a double, and there's a bomb on the feet of Hardzow. They look up, and he knocks him down. Two v three, and 18 seconds to get that bomb back. Hardzow won't let them in. He's looking for the ace. Nithon just trying to buy time, and there's not much of it. 10 seconds. The orb shot will not be baited, and he crab walks in for the no scope to. Yeah. Anyone. Oh, Orb saw him go main. They were ready, but TRK hits a blinder. It's a main split. Bigger Zera shuts it down on top yet again. Two on four. Pain. They've got the bomb in their sights. They've got three on the site. Pesadeo's looking for that hot roof man. He knows he's got him tucked in right now. Ducks the flash. He still hasn't cleared it. He thinks he has. He thinks his player's back sight. And while there is one there, there's another man. And Pesadeo's taken two. Or oh, now providing cover. But they've already swung out. Maluki on the shot. They drop in. Neck is now back of the site. There's only 18 seconds. He swings. He wins. Pain. Get it back. And trading rounds. A site for team one. They feel like their hands are tied, and so they've got to commit into the B site, into this stack. Neck is just dancing around and buying time, plays it to perfection. Nice. 
Gives time for Nython to oh. get stuck in, and so Pesadeo left in this clutch. Deals with the first, he's got Maybe. 10 seconds as he sprints through the vents. They're right behind him, but he's gonna get past Hards out into the A site. Five seconds, <laughs> taps the bomb, up through the vent is the first, but he can't win the round. Nython locks it into time, and so Payne are on to four. Held it together where it mattered most. And now this should be the easiest of them all, should be. PKL started off, and this is it. Team one, four frags away from elimination. Oh, Nithon, good kill. Helped out by Big Azera. And the push, it's just disjointed. The utility slowed them down. They've got to try and get out ramp. This is Nekaz's domain, and he's dropped the bomb. Maluki, as good as this man's been, try as hard as he might, as many clutches as he's delivered. It's so stacked against him, and there he is, falling at the last hurdle.